Hi, this is Jeremy from World Possible. We're going to do a quick introduction to the Rachel Plus server. This is our new server in the Rachel lineup. Um, if you're new to World Possible and Rachel, Rachel is a collection of website copies that we put on a particular device. That device creates a wireless hotspot in a region that has no internet um, or no other wireless connectivity or limited wireless connectivity and enables local access to those website copies. Uh, so people feel like they're on the internet without having to pay for internet or any subscriptions or any fees. You just get one of these devices and you turn it on and people in a remote location will feel like they're online. This is the new Rachel Plus device. Um, it's developed by Intel and Intel Education. It's got an Intel processor inside it and a, a whole host of other features we'll go through. When you get the box, um, you'll see this sticker on the front. It's got the name of the wireless signal that we're creating, a password for the wireless, um, and then some instructions about how to access both the content as a user and the content as a teacher. This device has a nice portal that allows teachers to upload videos, PDFs, um, any other digital content and make it available to anyone in their community. And as always, our contact information for support. So uh, when you get this device, you'll open it up and you'll see uh, the Rachel Plus inside it. This is about two pounds. Um, it's got some information about how to access the, the signal itself, uh, some logos from some of the content providers. This device has 500 gigabytes of storage. Uh, that's about 10 times the normal storage you're used to if you've been using our Rachel Pies in the past. Uh, this device also, when turned on, will create a wireless signal that up to 50 computers can connect to at once, computers, laptops, tablets, uh, what's really great about this device is also you'll see here uh, This allows us to remotely connect to these devices So if you've got this in a village in Tanzania and every few months you can bring it into a city center or somewhere And you can connect it to the internet uh, Via this cable down here. We can talk to that device We can upload the content or update the content inside it and we can also pull down some usage information so we can know how much um, content is being used and what content is being used other things real quickly in this box, uh, this is a wall mount so that you can stick it up to the wall. Uh, it comes also with a power supply. This has a US plug and about a six foot cable. And here are some screws so you can actually mount this uh, to the wall inside your classroom or community center or library. So this is pretty much uh, the extent of the hard drive, or excuse me, the hardware here. Um, there's a lot more information about the content inside it on some further videos. Uh, the preloaded English version, which most people come to, has about 300 gigabytes of content. Uh, you'll see some of these content providers, including TED, Practical Action, Radio Lab. There's also a host of other content available on our website um, and some instructions about how you can load more content that may be specialized for your particular deployment. Thanks.